Hey guys, what's up? My name's The Scroll and welcome back to RS3. So welcome to my first episode of my rebuild series. So I lost my bank speaking, that was a total of 700 million and now I'm rebuilding. And yeah, let's get this started. So you might have known but I sold my miscellaneous loot for 15 mil or so so that I can start with that money and I also sold some of my supplies for PVM so that I can buy the Dragon Rider lands so that I can start making my money back in Araxor and in the Furies. The Dragon Rider lands is a very good alternative with the Noxious Scythe since the difference between them is only the damage and when I bought this weapon it was only 25 to 30 million or so so that was a pretty good investment so hopefully we can get our money back and yeah so my plan was to go to Araxor and kill him so that I can get maybe some leg pieces or some weapon hilts or something my favorite rotations are path 1 and 3 and I'll be using path 1 for that path 1 and 2 is also viable but I would take the middle for that since you know middle path is kinda easy and also my most favorite so far is path 2 and 3 because this rotation is the fastest and I really like the fast kills especially with the noxious scythe and in this case the dragon rider lance so I was hoping to get the middle leg since I already have the top leg and that would be pretty convenient if I got the middle leg and the bottom leg pretty fast in Araxor and I would have been able to get at least one noxious weapon back. But the typical Jagex gave me the wrong RNG and gave me the spider fang. So it's the most expensive hilt at the moment but I don't have the leg and I would not recommend trust trading I guess. And also I have no money for a leg so it's staying in my bank collecting dust at the moment so that sucks man so I'm still hoping to get the other legs and maybe I can get lucky uh, so yeah freaking wish me some good luck so moving on to furies and yeah so today it's path 1 and 3 rotation I, I don't really feel the the rhythm inside me to do the path 3 since path 1 and 3 rotation at path 3 is pretty annoying so uh, I'm gonna do some furies today I guess Ah yes, Jagex, you finally gave me the good RNG. Didn't even take a while to get this Zamorak crest. Uh, so yeah, I'm thankful for that, Jagex. Yay! Okay, a weapon piece, not too bad. Nemora's blade, maybe worth three mil. Not too bad. Okay, I got a freaking Nemora's blade again. I don't know why it's Nemora always. Uh, I don't know. What the hell? Another one? Oh, I wish I could have gotten this RNG at Vindicta. Jesus. Ah, I sense the dry stray coming in. Um, I got a dormant chest, I guess. Uh, that's fine. So I continued killing Furies on and on and on. And yeah, guess what happened? Hey, Bob. Give me a freaking drum roll, please. Okay, there we go. So yeah, there we go. Surprisingly, I got the Nemora pet after getting all those weapons from Nemora as well. Um, Jagex, uh, is this your way of converting my loss into a freaking pet? Maybe it's worth it. Also, I'm really really sorry for those people that are going for the pet. I might have gotten it at 402 kills or so after the first threshold. And that's pretty fortunate for me, I guess, since I am at a dry streak at Queen Black Dragon. I haven't even gotten the pet yet. So yeah, hmm. Well, I guess Nemora is a pretty cool pet. Also, I took a screenshot instead of recording it since I didn't open Bandicam in time and the Twin Furies were already respawning so I had to screenshot so that I can get a good thumbnail or something. Maybe I'll use it in a thumbnail. So yeah, I decided to convert my Fury tokens into Zaro's reputation since I am grinding Vindicta next and I'm still doing the bounties for them so that I can get it up to 5000 reputation so that I can get the extra perks you get when you have it full. So yeah, wish me luck on that. And after doing that, I sold all of my common drops that are collected in my bank from Araxi and Furies and I got a total of 36 million or so. 
that's pretty good actually they are good money and the rares i will keep them in the bank until i sell them for a noxious weapon i think i'll be going for noxious staff first since talos is coming out and i think magic will be effective there as i have seen in the videos and i've attempted to kill him with the dragon rider lance but it didn't really work out well i died too many times and my malevolent armor is out of charges because of it so yeah that sucks and i guess that's about it for this episode uh nothing really big happened except for the pet drop and i didn't farm enough bosses since uh, my internet went out for a week but i'll make sure to get that juicy noxious stuff next episode so stay tuned for that and i think i'll be uploading a vindicta video next since i already have full reputation in there and that will be pretty cool if I got the same luck at Furies at Vindicta. Maybe I'll do some Corporal Beast along those lines since I almost have the engineering tokens for the Chaotic Spear. So yeah, maybe a loot video at Corporal Beast. I don't know. And I think after those two videos, episode 2 will be released. And by then, I'll be making bank. And also, I'll be doing Araxi along those lines as well. But I won't be making another video of Araxi pretty soon. And yeah, I guess that sums up the whole video. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, stay awesome and farewell.